Imagine the tantalizing aroma of fresh vegetables, slowly simmered in a fragrant blend of garlic, tomatoes, and herbs. This is no ordinary dish, this is ratatouille, a world-famous French classic. Originating from the sun-kissed region of Provence in the south of France, ratatouille is a beloved part of French cuisine. Its name derived from the French words rata, meaning chunky stew, and tuye, translating to toss or stir, paints a vivid picture of the preparation process. The beauty of ratatouille lies in its simplicity. It's a humble peasant dish, born out of the necessity to make use of surplus summer vegetables, yet, it's managed to carve out its place in the annals of gourmet cuisine. It's a testament to the French culinary philosophy, where quality ingredients are the star, and simplicity is the key to unlocking their full potential. Ratatouille is a medley of eggplant, zucchini, bell peppers and onions, all bathed in a rich tomato sauce infused with garlic and herb de Provence. Each vegetable is sautéed separately to maintain its integrity and flavor before they're all combined and simmered to perfection. The result is a vibrant hearty stew brimming with the flavors of summer, but ratatouille is more than just a dish. It's a celebration of the French love for fresh seasonal produce. It's a tribute to the art of slow cooking, where flavors are given the time to meld and intensify, and it's a reflection of the French way of life, where meals are savored, not rushed. So, whether you're served ratatouille as a main course, a side dish, or even as a filling for crepes, you're not just tasting a medley of vegetables, you're experiencing a slice of French culture, a piece of culinary history, and a testament to the enduring appeal of simple honest food. Now, if that doesn't make you want to hop on the next flight to France, stay tuned, we have more delicious dishes ahead. From the heart of Italy to the farthest corners of the globe, pizza has won hearts and satisfied cravings. Yes, we're talking about the world's favorite flatbread. The humble pizza began its journey in Naples. Back in the late 18th century, the Neapolitans needed a quick and tasty meal during their long work days, and thus, the pizza was born. With a simple flatbread topped with tomatoes and cheese, it was an affordable and filling meal for the hard-working people of Naples. As Italians emigrated, they took pizza with them, introducing it to the United States where it underwent a transformation. It was the American pizza that introduced the world to pizza with toppings galore, from pepperoni to pineapple and everything in between. Today, you can find a pizza to satisfy any palate, with every culture adding their unique spin to it. But let's not forget the traditional way of making pizza. It starts with a perfect dough, hand-stretched to create a thin base with a puffed-up, pillowy edge. The dough is then topped with a rich tomato sauce made from San Marzano tomatoes and fresh, creamy mozzarella cheese. A few leaves of basil, a drizzle of olive oil, and into the wood-fired oven it goes. The result is a perfect Neapolitan pizza, slightly charred, bubbling with cheese, and bursting with flavors. Pizza's popularity is undeniable. It's a global sensation, beloved by all, from New York to Tokyo, Sydney to Moscow. It's a testament to its versatility and universal appeal. It's a dish that can be enjoyed in a fancy restaurant, in a bustling city pizzeria, or in the comfort of your own home. It's the perfect food for any occasion, a quick lunch, a late-night snack, a party food, or a comfort food. It can be customized to suit any dietary needs, vegetarian, vegan, gluten-free, you name it. It's a food that brings people together, a food that has become a part of our collective food culture. Pizza is a dish that has truly conquered the world. But hold on, our culinary journey is just beginning. Bite into a crunchy shell filled with flavorful meat topped with fresh salsa and you are in for a Mexican fiesta. Yes, we're talking about tacos. Now let's take a journey back in time to unravel the history of this iconic dish. While the exact origins of the taco are unknown, it's believed to have been born in the silver mines of Mexico in the 18th century. The term taco referred to the little explosives miners used to extract the ore. These were pieces of paper wrapped around gunpowder and placed into holes carved in the rock. Sound familiar? That's right, just like the tortilla wrapped around tasty fillings. Fast forward to the 20th century, tacos found their way to the United States and quickly became a beloved fast food item. Today they're a staple in Mexican cuisine and a symbol of its rich cultural heritage. But what makes tacos so special? Well, it's all about the perfect blend of simple, fresh ingredients. Here's a quick guide on how they're made. First, a corn or wheat tortilla is heated until it's soft and pliable. Then, it's filled with your choice of meat. This could be anything from succulent grilled chicken to slow-cooked beef or even fresh seafood. Vegetarians, don't worry, there are plenty of options for you too, like beans, cheese, or grilled veggies. 
Next comes the toppings. A traditional taco is often adorned with a sprinkle of chopped onions and cilantro, a squeeze of lime and a spoonful of salsa. Some might add a dollop of sour cream or a sprinkle of cheese. The possibilities are endless, and there you have it, a perfect taco. It's a dish that's as diverse as the people who enjoy it. Whether you're sitting at a street-side stand in Mexico City or at a trendy taco truck in Los Angeles, you'll find that each taco tells a story of tradition, creativity, and cultural fusion. With tacos, every bite is a celebration, but we're not done yet. We have more culinary delights to explore. Sink your teeth into a juicy beef patty sandwiched between two soft buns, and you'll know why the hamburger is an American classic. The tale of the hamburger takes us back to the 19th century. Interestingly, it wasn't born in the United States, but in the bustling ports of Hamburg, Germany. The city was renowned for its high-quality beef, and the sailors who docked there took the idea of ground beef patties back to their homelands. When German immigrants crossed the Atlantic, they brought this culinary delight with them, and the hamburger found its new home in America. In the late 19th century, the hamburger started its evolution. The idea of sandwiching the beef patty between two slices of bread was born, and the hamburger as we know it today started to take shape. In the early 20th century, the hamburger became a staple at American fairs and carnivals, earning its status as a symbol of fun, convenience, and American ingenuity. As the years rolled on, the hamburger continued to evolve. It was no longer just a beef patty between two buns, it became a canvas for culinary creativity. Chefs began experimenting with different toppings, sauces, and even types of bread. From the classic cheeseburger to the extravagant gourmet versions, the hamburger has shown that it can wear many hats. But the hamburger's influence didn't stop at the American borders. As fast food culture spread across the globe in the mid-20th century, the hamburger went international. Today, you can find a hamburger in almost every corner of the world, each with its unique local twist. The hamburger is more than just a meal. It's a testament to the power of simplicity, the joy of creativity, and the potential of a single dish to connect cultures and people. It's a symbol of America's culinary influence and a global favorite that has stood the test of time. The hamburger, a simple dish that has left a huge mark on the culinary world. But we're not stopping here, the best is yet to come. Imagine a delicate balance of flavors, a harmony of taste, texture, and appearance. This is sushi, the world-renowned Japanese delicacy. Now let's delve into the art of making sushi. Crafting sushi is a meticulous process that requires precision, patience, and an appreciation for the finest details. The sushi chef, or itamai, must master a multitude of skills, from selecting the freshest fish to preparing the perfect sushi rice. It's an art form that takes years, even decades to perfect, and it's this dedication that makes sushi so special. The cultural significance of sushi in Japan cannot be overstated. It's not just food, but a piece of Japan's history and heritage. Originating in the 7th century as a method of preserving fish, sushi has evolved into a culinary symbol of Japan, enjoyed during special occasions and casual get-togethers alike. The sushi bar, with its intimate setting, offers a unique dining experience where patrons can watch and interact with the itamai, making every bite a memorable one. But sushi is not confined to Japan, its global appeal is undeniable. From New York to London, from Sydney to Sao Paulo, sushi has taken the world by storm. It has been reinvented and reimagined, with fusion varieties incorporating local ingredients, demonstrating the versatility of sushi. Yet at its core, sushi remains true to its origins, a testament to the enduring charm of Japanese cuisine. The allure of sushi lies not just in its taste, but in its presentation. Each piece is a work of art, with the vibrant colors of the fish contrasting against the white rice and the green nori. The wasabi, ginger, and soy sauce that accompany sushi further enhance its flavors, creating a gastronomic experience that is both visually and palatably pleasing. Sushi, a dish that encapsulates the sophistication and subtlety of Japanese cuisine. And with that, our culinary journey ends, but the adventure doesn't have to stop.